Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing September favorites. So if you guys are interested, then keep watching. I can't believe that one month of autumn is already gone. However, I'm feeling good. I actually am really enjoying autumn, loving all the autumn colors, hot drinks, layering up, being a bit lazy. Who doesn't love a bit of that? I have a little kitten on my lap. So hopefully she will just sleep and not distract me too much. However, her cuteness is very distracting. I have really random items, so I'm just gonna pick whatever is there. The first thing I wanted to tell you about is this uh, Neil's Yard bath salt. And when it gets into colder weather, I definitely take more baths. And I know that there are a lot of people out there that actually don't enjoy baths at all. I am definitely not that person. I love a good bath, however, I cannot stay too long in a bath, like Jay, for example. He can stay in it for like hours, like literally two hours in a scorching hot bath. Mine is like tepid, literally. I don't like very hot water and I can stay for about half an hour, 40 minutes maximum if I am watching something. I'm usually like watching, I don't know, MasterChef Bake Off, something like that. Jay's mom and dad actually gave this to me as a present and these are the lavender ones and they are amazing. They come in this beautiful little bag and with a little scoop like this, so you just scoop a couple of scoops, throw them in the water while the bath is filling up and it just, the aroma of it is amazing. But also what I found is that when I take a bath after like exercising or after a really long day, my muscles really relax and that's obviously the Epsom salts in, in here, uh, which really help your muscles to like soothe and relax. Then I have a cleanser that I have been loving, loving in September. And that's because my skin really got dry. It got really dry, which is quite unusual for me. However, I did have a facial uh, very recently where I had a peel and I think maybe that affected it a little bit as well. I have been using the CEO Micro Dissolve Cleansing Oil from Sunday Riley. I love Sunday Riley, especially the UFO oil. You, you saw me, if you watched my videos before, that I use quite a lot of it on the, like, on my chin area. When I'm breaking out, it's a great clarifying oil. This one is so, so nice. It's so, so gentle and so mild. You can use it on your eyes. It removes makeup very well. It's not a foaming cleanser. It's not a drying cleanser. It's not too rich. It doesn't clog your pores. And this also has willow bark extract, which will really mildly exfoliate. So it kind of has those, you know, benefits of BHA and AHA um, acids and I think it also has lime pearl extract um, so really great ingredients in here I also love that it comes in a pump and it's really lovely and cute and bright and orange also because this summer I actually didn't really get a tan I don't use sun beds I don't really use fake tan during you know any month of the year usually you find me in the shade under umbrella so I have already reached for my self tanning lotion this is the Lavera one and this is organic and this is the only self tanning lotion that I will use it's really great at moisturizing your body it's not streaky at all. It does have a little bit of that biscuity smell, but not too strong because I actually can't stand it. So if it smells very strong, it's a no-no for me. But this one is lovely. It's cruelty-free. It's all organic ingredients. It just gives you a bit of a warmer glow to your skin rather than, you know, a really deep tan. Then I have some supplements that I wanted to show you that I have been using for not just September. I kind of started um, mid-August taking them. You guys know I take supplements like all the time, some sort of supplements, but um, I do change my supplements depending on the season, depending on how I'm feeling. Always start taking vitamin C when it gets to cold a month because vitamin C is amazing for your immune system. I think this is pretty much uh, just pure vitamin C. It does not contain any sugar, any salt, any starch, any soya. Advanced Nutrition Program is a supplement that I normally take. I trust this brand. I know that they, they work for me. So these are just the ones that work for me. And this is the packaging that they come in. 
and then you peel the top off like this and then obviously the cap goes on top. The vitamin C tablets are quite big um, but I have no problem swallowing tablets. However, if you do have a problem swallowing pills or tablets, you can always crush them and have them as a powder or mix them into water. And the same is with capsules. When capsules, you know, can be quite big, you can always separate the capsule and get the powder out, mix it with water and take it like this. And then the other one that I'm taking at the moment is the skin of antioxidants. These are also from Advanced Nutrition Program. And this also has turmeric and it also has vitamin A, which is amazing for your skin. It's amazing for elasticity of your skin, for moisture of your skin, for any, you know, fine lines if you're fighting those. This are uh, how the capsules look. So it's like a half green, half white little pill. I actually really, really like the packaging. I love that the packaging is carton, so you can actually recycle those. I actually have some candles for you that were sent to me. And they were sent to me by Gianni. I hope I'm pronouncing um, the name right. And this is from the Essence Fragrances. I am a big fan of candles. I burn candles and um, oil diffusers in the house all the time. And I actually have one right there. And it's one of these. And I have to say that I am loving these candles so much. Thank you, Gianni, so much for sending them to me. I want to point out that the reason why I'm mentioning them is not because they were sent to me. I will never push anything to you that I personally don't enjoy. There are a lot of things that, you know, I get or, you know, someone sends me that I don't mention or, you know, I kind of get in trouble with brands because um, if I didn't like it, I didn't promote it or something like that. That happens as well. Not so much because, to be honest, I don't get that many um, things sent to me. I have never done a sponsored review. I have never done, you know, like a sponsored post or something like that. And they said that basically the policy behind this brand is that um, a lot of our memories are connected to different scents. And that is so true for me at least. There are so many scents and tastes that just trigger certain memories in my mind. And that is why the candles actually don't have any names. They do come with this really cute little carton that is just handwritten it's definitely handmade and all the so are the, all the candles they are soy candles and then it says for example this one is the rose petals and orange zest i absolutely love this one this one is actually usually downstairs so for example this one has top notes of rose and orange and cane sugar and then there's also kiwi, geranium. And you guys, these candles are so aromatic. They're so strong in scent. I have that one burning and it's literally like, it's filled this room so quickly. And also they come in this pretty velvet black pouches. And I personally love supporting smaller brands, you know, and brands that are, you know, just starting out or, you know, it's someone just making something at home that they are loving, but also they are actually creating a beautiful product. All the candles are non-toxic and actually they have a really strong hot and cold power scent kind of throw so you can smell them um, whether you're burning them or not. Other candle, the one that is burning there, is the Cotton Blossom and Mandarin Orange and that one is my absolute favorite. And all the candles are hand poured in California. So yeah, if you guys are interested, I will leave the link to them below. And then I have a product from Jane Idale that I have been enjoying this month. And I have to say, I've been pretty lazy with my makeup or, you know, I have been definitely going very natural with my makeup. But to be honest, if you guys have watched any of my Get Ready With Me, you will know that I am always wearing natural makeup. I was actually wondering, I have a lot of friends who are makeup artists that, you know, maybe I could invite them over and we could do like a tutorial. So if you guys want to see that, let me know because I have already, you know, spoken to them about it. So just let me know if you do want to see it and what kind of looks would you want to see from like a more professional person you know if they do it on me and you know we can just chat and talk you through it whatever I just thought it was an idea those of you who have been watching my channel for a while you guys will know that I like my life easy especially when it comes to my makeup not when it comes to my skincare however and that is why like one of my absolute favorite products is Charlotte Tilbury face in a palette that I did break and 
I could literally cry about that but hey the concept behind this is the same this has three different products in it and I absolutely love the packaging I showed you their highlighter that you know stacks the same way and there's a little mirror there the mirror is tiny but if you're just doing your eye makeup then it actually is fine a mineral powder then there is a blush and a three eyeshadows the blush is gorgeous quite shimmery blush but i don't mind the shimmery blush i go through stages of using matte blushes shimmery blushes this is a really beautiful coral like a peachy coral color it's gorgeous the mineral powder is one of like the best sellers of jane idol in general you can just set your makeup i just take you know a really big fluffy brush and Put it all over my face just to set my face a little bit you can absolutely use it on its own and um, just to give yourself a little bit of coverage and you know match yourself down if you're feeling a bit oily and then the eyeshadows are all shimmer they are all really beautiful and really easy to blend what i usually do is i do put like a matte you know eyeshadow base and maybe a little bit into the crease and then I reach for these been just taking this with me and just taking like a brow product a mascara and maybe some concealer and that's it and then the last thing I have here is a mask and this is a clay mask and this is called Alia Skin and this is a very much Instagram hyped product I had goes off for um, Alia marketing team that they have reached out to so many bloggers and sent it out to so many people to promote the product so much because you know what for me it works when I see something that looks pretty that will look pretty on my shelf and the ingredients actually are quite you know attractive to me uh, I say yes I say yes sign me up I couldn't stay away and I did try it as well and this is a clay based mask and this is pink clay the cowling clay which is great for breakouts it's great to dry them out it's great to get any impurities out of your skin detoxify the skin really cleanse it and i have been using it for a couple of weeks now i try to use a clay mask about once a week because it can be very drying on your skin however um if you are breaking out which i have been doing like for example on my chin area i will just apply it on the chin area and also i had like a few little spots on my forehead so what i did i literally took a little bit and put it just on the spot and in the morning it really really dries them out and this is also cruelty free which is great and the packaging is so pretty you guys it's just like this pink matte gorgeous thing almost forgot about another thing that i wanted to mention if you guys love to meditate or you have trouble sleeping then i wanted to recommend to you a guy on youtube in fact that does um meditation videos like talking you through it or there is just you know like really calm soothing music the guy is called jason stevenson i believe he's based in australia and all the videos are obviously free and i have tried so many apps um like meditation apps because i have quite a lot of trouble sleeping like through the night or i dream a lot so you know it's quite a disturbed sleep he does like deeper sleep music peaceful sleep music but then he also does guided sleep meditation and this is just like a personal recommendation of mine obviously it's not in any way shape or form sponsored but if you like to listen to something when you go to sleep then try that one i will leave the link to his channel below so you can check it out anyways you guys i hope you're all having a wonderful day and that you're all doing well if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet you can do it now you can also hit the bell because then you will be notified about my videos that i post every tuesday and every friday and yeah i love you all very very much and i will see you very soon in my next video